Welcome to Selenium Master video tutorial. In this video tutorial, I will explain how to run Selenium Robot Framework tests against different browsers. When testing web applications, it is very important to test applications compatibility with different browsers. Nowadays, some people use Firefox, other people use Google Chrome, and some other people may use Internet Explorer or other browsers. After a test script is created, we should run the test against different browsers and verify that the application should work with all types of browsers without any issue. Let's use the Mahara test project login test suite as an example. In this example, we have valid user login. We have logout test cases. Valid user login, it open browser, maximize browser window, wait until the submit button is displayed and input username input password click on the submit button and verify that page should contain the element logout link and in the logout test case we wait until the logout link is displayed and click on logout link wait until the submit button is displayed and the, we do assertion on the submit button. In order to run the test against different browser, we defined a variable browser. This variable is defined under login suite and by default we for the value we give Firefox. Now in the command line we pass different browser as the parameter so the test will run against that browser. So before we start the test with command line I would like to explain two drivers needed for this test. In order to run the test against Chrome driver, against Google Chrome, we need to download Chrome driver from Google site and put the driver under the folder where the test script is located or we can add the path to the environment variable. And also, to run the test against Internet Explorer, we need to define the path for Internet Explorer or we need to download the IE driver server.exe and save it under the uh, test script folder. Now let's run the test against Firefox. So in the command line window, we type in the command pybot dash dash timestamp outputs dash dash variable browser ff represents Firefox login suite.txt is the test script file. The parameter timestamp outputs append the timestamp to the result file. So let's press enter. So if you look at the test result, login test, logout test is passed, browser closed. So this means the application 
login and logout test case is working fine against Firefox. Let's run this against Chrome. So let's change the uh, browser value. Put Chrome and press enter. Now the script launched Chrome browser and executes each step. So in this test result, the logout link verification failed. This does not mean the application is not compatible with the Chrome browser because the login script has uh, passed, login test has passed. The link did not get recognized by the Chrome driver. So we need to fix the element locator uh, by looking at some documentations. Now let's run the test against Internet Explorer. Let's change the Chrome to IE. So this opened up Internet Explorer. So it seems that the robot framework Selenium 2 library interaction with Internet Explorer browser is a little bit slow. Since our purpose is to verify the test script, let's wait until the test is completed. Username has been entered. Now the robot framework types in password. So when looking at the test result, we see that both login test case and logout test case passed. This means this application is compatible with Firefox, Google Chrome, and Internet Explorer. In this video tutorial, I explained how to run robot framework test against different browsers. So in summary, you need to define a global variable for the browser and pass the browser name as a value in each test execution. For more information on robot framework and the examples, please visit www.seleniummaster.com Thanks for watching.